Hey YouTube, this is a video on how to download a file from Visual C Sharp, like programmatic programmatically, and show a progress bar which shows the progress in bytes while you download it. At first, let's open up Visual C Sharp. Create a new project as a Windows form. And now let's add a progress bar. Let's add it anywhere on the form. Okay, now we don't need to do anything else except um, just do the coding. We're going to need to put a using system.net and then on form one load, create a new web client. And then we're going to have to create a few events. Download progress change plus equal. And press tab twice to insert it and insert the method. And this this void will happen when the download progress changes. So and this is this is where you're going to change the progress bar amount. And this is when I'm when um, the download completes. And this is the important part because I've messed up on it before. But if you download file, then it will do it on the um, current thread, which means like nothing else can happen, and it could take a while. And the progress bar value won't change, so you need to do download file async which starts the download on another thread so stuff on the main form can still happen without being interrupted let's, uh, let's put in the URI and I have it I have it copied which is Eclipse which is my friend Omega Sniper's it's his program okay, let's finish that and then put the file name where you want to download it I'm going to download it to my um, desktop Okay, and there you go. That's all you need to do for the main form one load. Now we need to do client download progress change. A progress bar one dot maximum value equals E, which is the event arguments dot total bytes to receive. Progress bar one dot value equals E dot bytes received. Wait, um, one second. Oh, I know what I did wrong. And now we're just going to need to cast this as an int because right now it's a long. Actually, yeah. It just cast as an int. to make sure it's small enough and I think this should work let's try it out yep it's downloading takes a second because this file is about 10 megabytes But yeah, you can use this to make an update, or it makes it look a lot nicer than just updating without any progress showing. And download has completed, and now let's go look at my desktop. And there's Eclipse copy right here. You can go back to the beginning of the video, and it wasn't there then, if you don't believe me. But yep. Thanks for watching and please subscribe.